you all doing today? Welcome to In a Beauty with Bhavna. Today I'm going to share a recipe with okra, or in some countries it's called lady fingers, and in India it's called bindi. This recipe includes yogurt, so it's called yogurt okra curry recipe. So let's begin. First of all, you need to wash the okra properly and dry it with a clean cloth because if we leave the water in okra, as you can see, it has a gluey, sticky substance while cooking. So it will give more extra gluey substance. So we don't want that. So we wash it, dry it with a clean cloth. So I've taken around two cups of uh, okra, roughly chopped. And here is coriander and green chili chopped. About one teaspoon of ginger. One cup of yogurt. Two tablespoons of tomato paste. We'll need cumin seed. Salt to taste. Coriander and cumin powder. Two tablespoons of fennel powder, roughly. I have grinded it roughly, as you can see. There are still a bit of fennel chunks. It'll give an extra flavor. We will need one teaspoon of red chili powder. That's optional. If you don't want red chili, that's all right. We will also need one teaspoon of garam masala. I have the homemade recipe in my channel. I'll put the link below in the description. We will need one teaspoon of turmeric powder, three to five cloves and three to five cardamom. We will need also olive oil. big tablespoons of olive oil and I'll on the gas and let the oil heat up. As the oil has heated up now I'm just going to add the okra into it and let it cook. So I'm going to fry it till the okra gets cooked. Beautiful. As you can see, the okra has been fried properly. Now I'm just going to transfer the okra into a plate and we'll start with the curry. Now, uh, in the same pan, I have added a little bit more olive oil and now I'm just going to add the cumin seed, the cardamom and the cloves. You just give a good stir and let it turn slightly brown. As the cumin seeds have been cooked, it's slightly brown. Now I'm just going to add the ginger paste and give it a good stir. is cooked now I'm just going to add the tomato paste two tablespoons of tomato paste and I'm going to give a good stir now I'm going to add all the spices the cumin powder the coriander powder the fennel powder, red chili powder, turmeric, everything. I'm just going to add it and I will add salt to taste. Now 
And now I'm going to give a good stir. There we go. As you can see, the masala is... And already the aroma is divine. It's beautiful. And I'll just add a bit of coriander and green chili. And give a good stir. Give a good stir. I will keep on stirring it till the oil separates from the curry. to separate and now we're going to add back the okra and give a good stir Yogurt okra curry is ready and I'm just going to garnish with the coriander and green chili chopped. So I'm just going to garnish a little bit. Outstanding. Beautiful. Yogurt okra curry is ready. You can serve it with anything, bread, non-bread, roti, rice, whatever you like. I hope you all liked this video. If you did, please like, share, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to press the bell icon. Have a great day, everyone. Take care. Bye.